Okay. Well, welcome everybody. We're AJ and Jill Willoughby, and this is our first of the I'm In Now What series. And this is going to be a training, and I'll let you all know, uh, for those that have been in for quite some time, a lot of this is going to sound like, oh, I already know that. I know that, but it's going to be a good refresher for you. For those that are just now getting started, and uh, maybe you just signed up just uh, the last few days or the last month or so, or you're just kind of trying to figure out, hey, I'm not really sure where to go, what do I do next? That's what this call is about. And as we continue doing these in the future, this is going to be for you to get your new people on because we're going to be teaching and showing how to get things started the right way from the get-go, where to go. And then we're going to have some other advanced uh, trainings that we're going to be doing. And, and when I say advanced, you know, we're, we're still going to be sticking with some of the basics, but uh, we'll, we'll get it. It'll be a little bit more than some of the things that you're going to find the uh, preliminaries that we're going to be going through tonight. Right. So, First of all, I want to talk just a second about our internet service here. I hope we're not super choppy. Um, we did increase our, we did boost our power today. So hopefully the next call, if this one's choppy, hopefully the next one won't be. Um, but we just thank you so much for being on. Um, this is our first of many and we will repeat this. Um, be on here every week and have your team on here every week. It'll get repetitious, but that's how we learn, right? You just keep making things um, a pattern. Am I kicking the table? Sorry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so what I want to say, though, is that, yeah, AJ and I decided we wanted to host this. Um, the reason why we wanted to do this was because we've got uh, last month alone, we had over 400 new people in our team. And I get the same phone calls and questions every day. And with that, and I don't say that to brag or anything, but I can't answer 400 phone calls of the same things every day, every day, every day, and neither can you guys. So what we're doing is we want to just give a brief overview of how you get started, what you need to do, the ins and outs of the housekeeping part of the business as far, and then the meat and potatoes on how you share this business and these products with, with people. But what I want to start with, though, is that this isn't about AJ and I. It's not about what we've done or what we do or anything that, um, any successes or failures that we've had. This is about you. This call is about you. Everybody has a different goal. Everybody has a different life situation. Everybody is in their own place in time. This is about your journey. This is about your life, about your future, about your health. And, you know, we can all, there's, this company is brand new. We're, we're just now, what, five months old. So we are, we are, just now, we're all just now getting started. So, so this is a great time to get these calls started each week. Um, but I will say, you know, as much as with a new company, there's a lot of energy, there's a lot of excitement, there's a lot of enthusiasm. And if you're on Facebook at all, then you see that energy, you see that excitement. And I will tell you, and this is, this is only in members on these calls. Um, this is just training. I'm not, I'm not here to talk to you about all the different product trainings. This is going to be about a business training. Um, you can ride that wave of enthusiasm and you can ride that wave of excitement, but what you can't ride, you can't ride that wave of success that comes down to Y O U you and you have to have a why you have to know what you're going after. Um, AJ's grandma, Emma Lyman, uh, she is a, she was a legend in, in this industry. And she, she would always say at every meeting, whether you think you can or think you cannot, you're right. Because I will tell you that before you can be successful in anything, you have to get it in your mind that you can be. And if you think that you can't be, it's time to really feed your mind, feed your brain. Um, you can hear AJ and I talk all night long and you can hear great speakers we've got you know uh, Leonard Tillman on here and Walter and and Tommy and and some of these Andy Willoughby and and Naomi and Sherman that could talk your ear off and you could learn a lot from them um, the fact of the matter though is at the end of the day the most powerful dialect the most powerful conversation that you will have is the conversation that you have with yourself that inner dialect that you have and I know that I'm kind of starting off, but I wanted to start off with this because it's so important as we get going that, Walt, you changed your hat again. Oh, my word. So sorry. 
distraction there. <laughs> In this business, we say to discipline your distractions. I just totally got distracted by the ad. So what I really just want to share with you is that inner di dialect. And if you have, if you've had failures, if you've had, and I don't really call them failures, I say that you succeeded in learning what not to do, right? So, so whether you've had success or not, you've got to decide that this is for you and you're here. So you've already made that decision. So this isn't an opportunity call. This is for you. You're here. You're not here by accident. You chose to be here and you chose to learn. You chose to invest some, some time into these products and some time tonight into training and learning for your business. So you're already a step ahead of the game. And so I commend you for that, but really, really um, discipline that inner dialect that you have with yourself. And you might, there might be things that we talk about that may be new to you, that may be uncomfortable for you, or you don't, whatever. You've got to make those decisions. If you think you can or think you cannot, you are right. So really start feeding your brain in, in changing the way you're, you're speaking to yourself and changing that inner dialect. Um, with that said, let's get to uh, the nuts and bolts of everything. And I want to start, first of all, with some... Um, basic back office training. Let's say uh, I'm talking to you as if you just came on board and you have no idea what you've got in front of you as far as the business side other than you know products are coming to you. So I'm going to share my screen here and see if I can pull up slides here. I already hit it. But okay. Um, so we're gonna go, let me make sure they can still hear me. Sorry. There we go. All, All right. right, so this is my, yeah, this is my computer. AJ doesn't have the pretty little flower screen, so. <laughs> now, let's see. You all need to let me know if you cannot hear me. I, you should be able to still hear me talk um, as we go through here. So let me know if there is. Okay. All right. Let's see. Make sure everyone can hear. Uh, let's... Ah, there we go. In our chat, we got chat. In the chat, tell us if you can hear it. Oh, here just fine. Great. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Samantha. All right. So what I want to go through is just a little bit of the back office training. Uh, I want everyone, if you've got it, um, grab pen, paper, um, type it out on your, your um, tablet or whatever you might have. But there's a few things that you need to write down and make sure that you know right off the bat. Um, those things right off the bat is your username. Do you know your username? Um, this was set up when you enrolled. Um, so if you did not do your own enrolling, if your in, uh, personal enroller signed you up, you need to make sure that you have that. Um, that is key into getting into your back office, but also key for your marketing sites. And I'll go through those with you as well. But make sure you know your username and password. If you don't know those, again, get with your personal enrollment, enroller and make sure that you have that. Um, and then make sure that you know the name of who personally enrolled you and their phone number. Make sure you have that. It's very, very important, especially when you hear what AJ has to say. And then secondly, make sure that you have that person's personal enroller and their phone number. You can go further and further and further if you want to with that, but I want everyone to at least make sure that you have those two. Why do you need both of them? Well, for one thing, if you do, if we do the three-way calls and different things like that, you need a support network. Um, this is a network. We are members.network, M network. And so this is about networking with one another. And guess what? I do sleep at night. Um, sorry, Jody. Sorry, my Australians, but I do sleep at night most of the time. And so, you know, if I'm not available, maybe he's up, you know, or maybe Andy's awake or whatever, or John Zenas is awake. So it's, it's one of those things that we do definitely, we team up together with that. So you make sure you have your support team in place. Um, the other thing that we'll talk about, and I'll go to the next slide, is your um, websites. Get on the next page. 
with M, with most companies I've ever seen or been involved in, you have to pay extra every month for your website. Sometimes they'll offer you an incentive in the beginning that you get them for your first 30 days and then it's $25 a month for each site you have. You actually have four with M Network that's totally free of charge. Now, M did everything different. They did everything different um, with this company. In and a good way. In a good way. And I love that because they realized, you know, when Carrie and Nate and, and Ryan and, and the others all got together, they knew the world does not need another network marketing company. What they needed was something totally different that would change networking so that people like AJ and I, people like, um, like, Kelvin on the on the call tonight and Tommy and Leonard that there was something they wanted we're all seeking this type of opportunity but uh, it, it's really it's really uh, just one of those those things that they really just change the way they do it make it the the right way um, the way it should have been from the beginning but but with technology it's so much greater so with that being said your username this is where it comes into play uh, for your replicated sites your username dot m dot network. If you're brand new, <laughs> do not add www to that. Do not put dot com at the end. Your retail website, this is where you're gonna send people um, that you might be retailing product to. Um, then you've got an opportunity site. This one's, this is my favorite. You actually have a couple here, but um, this one's my favorite for opportunity. Your username dot m dot network slash opportunity. Those that are looking for the business, and the product, then send them to that, that website. Um, then you also have a stick a day site, which is your username again, dot a stick a day dot com. Now with this one, this is where I might send more of someone that is not used to the industry, someone that hasn't ever looked at it, that doesn't quite understand how it goes because there's this great video right in the beginning um, that explains in a real quick little video how to get, how this works, how the whole thing, how it's all pictured together. So if they're brand new in the industry, this is definitely where I'd send them. Um, a lot of my millennials and whatever that have come in the business, I sent them to this site first and it is fantastic. Um, and then you have the presentation site as well that's your username.m.network slash presentation. What that site is, is just a, basically a presentation that you can take and show someone. It's like having a flip chart at your fingertips, uh, where, wherever you're at online, even at someone else's computer, you can log on to that and you've automatically right there got a presentation that you can show them. So those are your websites. That's where you send people to. Um, now, Let's talk about some back office stuff. Um, when you open your back office, and again, you can go to any of those websites and you click login. When you get to the login, it's gonna ask your username and password, which we already established that you gotta make sure you know. You log in, there's gonna be a lot of information on that homepage. Um, a lot of little blue boxes, a lot of things popping up here and there. But what I want you to focus, is, focus in on is that one blue box that says PTV, and that's called your personal team volume. This one is very, very important. Your, your group volume is important too because that's what you get paid on also, but your PTV will do a few things for you, and especially as you're getting started. And at the beginning when you get started, so you know, you're gonna see a lot of those numbers that really, you're not gonna see a whole lot populating yet. As you get going in the months to come, those numbers are gonna start really populating and you're gonna see a lot more happen there. Right, and when you first get on your back office before you've started um, building a team, uh, you really won't be able to see the functionality that the it's really awesome. It's it's the best back office I've ever seen. Um, but it has a lot of great functionality that you may not see right away. But as you start building your team, as your team's growing, your PTV, your group volume, all of that, as it's growing, uh, then you'll get to understand what all of that, all those functions do. But what I want you to focus on first is your rank. Now, I will say that AJ and I always teach don't chase a rank, chase a paycheck. And let me just say, when I talk paycheck, this is a business call. I do not apologize for the fact that I provide for my family, that I can spoil my grandbabies because I make a good income. I have no qualms about making money. Now, is money the only thing to this business? No, it's just one factor. But we're going to talk business tonight, so you're going to hear us talk about money, and that's okay. Um, that, that's what it's for. So, but when you get started, you may not know. There's always this kind of magical number in networking that people say, oh, I want $10,000 a month. 
but they're not willing to do the effort to even get $10 a month. You, you understand? So it's not a magic bean. It's not a gym membership that, that works out for you. It's a thing of you come in and you build a business. So sometimes it's hard when you're getting started to know what money goals to set. So start with, start with ranks. Start with that. So where are you at right now? If you just signed on and you've done 60 PV, personal volume of product, then you are a member. As you get 480 PTV in your team, then you're an M1. And I'm not going to go through the whole compensation plan, but I will just say if your goal here is to make some extra income or to build a business or to do like AJ and I and totally replace your income, then you need to start somewhere and start with ranks. What is your current rank? What is your next rank? What do I need to do to get to that next rank? There's a cool little feature. Um, I forgot what it's labeled, but you'll see it. it has the little dial that tells you the percentage that you can click on to see what you need still for the next rank. You can click furthermore and see the next couple of ranks or all the way to the to M6, I think. So, so you can do that. Really focus on where you're at and where you're going. Without a goal, you don't know where you're heading. You can't win a race if you don't know where the finish line is. So set those goals, whether they're short or long-term, set them both. Um, Remember, this is a business and you need to treat this like a business. So understanding where you're at and how to build your organization and what it is you need to get to the next level, those are important things so that you can set those goals so you know what direction to go. And again, for those that are listing just the audio and not seeing the, uh, the screen here, PTV, again, that stands for personal team volume. Your group volume, that is everybody, even including the spillover that comes into your organization from other people that are building uh, in your organization that may be uh, above you in the matrix. That is what you get paid on. You get paid on everything that comes in there. Your personal team volume, that's what determines your ranks of moving up. And the ranks is what determines how deep in your organization you're going to get paid. When you first come in, you're going to get paid four levels deep. As you increase in your ranks, those open up a couple more levels each time. Right. So let's look at some of the other features um, in the back office. And I'm not going to go into a lot of detail. A lot of it you can just go in and play around with. You're not going to break anything. And if you do, don't tell Ryan I told you to do that. Um, or that would be Nate, I guess. Um, so I want to go through just real quickly some of the features in the back office. Um, on the side or on the top, depending what type of device you're on, you'll see the different tabs. Um, so the first one is business. Um, on the business tab, you're going to see your team dashboard and your visual tree. Those are basically going to give you the exact same information, just different formats. The dashboard's more of a list. The visual tree is all written out with all the little graphics and where everyone's at. And so either way you want to look at them, that's great. They're really great places to, to see who's growing, what's happening in your business. Um, report center is just that. You can generate reports. They have some basic reports that you can just click and generate. Um, you could even customize reports if you'd like. Commissions. That's our favorite, right? So commissions are where you can go in here and you can see uh, your commissions being posted for both your weekly commissions and also your monthly commissions. Now, so let's talk about when you get paid. And then we'll talk about later how you get paid. So when you get paid is they generate commissions Mondays, which everyone used to hate Mondays. Monday is my favorite day of the week now because Mondays are payday. So every Monday, commissions are generated for weekly checks. The second Monday of every month, commissions are generated for your monthly earnings. So what you earned the previous month, you get paid the second Monday of the following month. Um, now, I will say for those of you across the pond, and I'm not sure about Canada, but these commissions are generated on Mondays. We've so far always received ours on Monday. Some of, them, some of you may receive the commissions then on Tuesday. So just understand that there may be a little, you know, it, it just takes a little bit of processing. So that you understand the difference between what your weekly paycheck is versus your monthly paycheck. Your weekly paycheck, that's going to be your fast starts. That's going to be the bonuses that you're going to get paid whenever you sign someone up in your organization, whether it's $25, $75, $150 per person that comes in. That's what you're going to see, and you're going to get paid that on a weekly basis. It goes from a Sunday or from a 
Monday morning to a Sunday night, so Monday at 12 a.m. to Sunday at 12 a.m. the following, is where it's determined, and you get paid the week later. So they don't pay it out like the very next day. It takes about a week for them to go, and they get it all processed, and then they get paid out to you. That is your weekly paycheck. Your monthly paycheck, that is from your matrix, your passive residual income, that is done as people are coming in throughout the month and buying product all throughout the month. So what I tell people with commissions is when you get started, start setting any monetary goals set with commissions. Um, there's the three packs to sign up with. You get commissions, $25, $75, or $150. If you came in and you paid $150 to come in, what happens if you turn around and sign someone up for that $499 pack and you just made $150. So it's really, you can really make your money back quickly. If you come in with a $4.99 and you bring in a few people, you've paid for that. I know we have seen um, some leaders on our team that have come in and and made over $500 our first week. Um, you know, it can be done, in, and it's something that it's not, it takes work, and you go in there and you do it, but it definitely, definitely um, pays out very well. Um, And then you start focusing then later on that monthly check because as you're building and you're getting those weekly checks, then you suddenly the second Monday of the month rolls around and you go, oh my gosh, what just happened? And that's really nice. But I will tell you, when you get started, um, networking is a multiplication business, but it is not when you first start. When you first start, it's addition. You enroll someone and you see them and oh, suddenly there's a new person in my matrix. That's great. And that person enrolls somebody and you enroll somebody and you've added three or four more. And, but before long, it really starts multiplying. Do not, do not, do not ever give up before you see that multiplication because that's when I hate the word magic, but that's when the magic happens. Um, so you've got to stay consistent and keep going until you see that multiplication because that's a beautiful, beautiful thing. Okay, moving on. New member enrollment. This is one of the many spots that you can enroll a new member. Um, you do not have to be logged in your back office to enroll a member. You can do that straight from your marketing site or they can even go in and enroll themselves. That's where I think actually is the easiest thing to do is to have someone go and log into your website at, uh, you know, whether it be your stick a day site, your opportunity site, one of those four sites that we were, that we were talking about at the beginning and they can go and they can sign up right there. I usually, whenever I'm taking someone and I'm signing someone out new, I'll go myself right there with them and I'll go to that end of it and I'll just sign them up from that spot. It's a whole lot easier, simple. It only takes a few minutes to uh, get it all done, and uh, they can see how quick it is. And I, I can't even tell how many times I get somebody that calls me up and says, I've, re- I've just recruited my first person. I have their information. What do I do? And I send them here, and it, I, I simply say, I am not going to tell you a word, but I'm going to be on the phone with you while you do it. And it is so easy that it, it kind of takes just being there with someone the first time, but it really is step by step. If you can go on and, and order anything from Amazon or anywhere like that, then you can definitely go through and put in a member enrollment. The next tab, and I'll go through these quicker, um, is orders. Of course, you've got your place and order, manager blue box and order history. Order history is very important, especially at the end of the year when you might need to print out those um, receipts for tax purposes. You might need to um, go back and and check a tracking on an order that you thought maybe you should have received by now. You can do all of that in order history. Um, Placing an order and blue box. Okay, your blue box, what that is, is that is um, just the clever way that M is. They have your blue box is your auto shipment, your um, subscription order. Uh, with Blue Box comes great um, advantages, such as it comes easily every month. Your shipping is five dollars flat um, on that. I, I think if you're Canada or outside of the U.S., it's a maybe a dollar more or something. But for me, if whether I order one box or twenty boxes, it's five dollars. You don't have to apologize for shipping costs. Now, if you just go in and place an additional order. I had someone ask me um, yesterday, how come the shipping went up? It was $6.95 for shipping. Well, that's the normal price for shipping um, if you're just placing an order. So if I go in and order extra product, then I'm going to have a little bit higher shipping, but it's still very, very reasonable shipping on all of it. Um, In addition to the affordable prices, like it's a no brainer. So tools, my favorite place and your new best friend 
is this tool section under documents and media. 90 to 95 percent of the questions you're going to have can be answered in the documents and media. There you're going to have all the graphics, even their font, their slides, the um, pictures of product. You're going to have the ingredient decks on the products. You're going to have all the flyers on any promotions, incentives, um, anything you need like that. The videos are back there. Everything you might need to know, if you're just, if it's the middle of the night and you can't sleep or whatever, hang out on this documents and media and spend some time. And um, if you're like me, and most people are not, because I'm kind of weird, um, I printed them out. I have a binder. Um, it's my pretty blue um, M Network binder because I'm, I'm weird like that and I don't always want to have to run to a website. So I printed some of the basic stuff out and I've got it right at my fingertips. You do not have to do that, but I like that. Um, calendar is is um, self-explanatory as well as community project prospect manager. That is a place where you could put your prospect's name and their contact information just so that you, if it's convenient to have it handy like that for you. Um, then your M gear, that's a fun place to go. That's where you can get your business cards, banners, um, t-shirts, hats, all the fun stuff. Um, we, yes, we have been um, hounding them like crazy that we are going to be getting some some new M water bottles on there very 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 soon and uh, so I mean we have this great drink product and and so I'm using generic bottles so we're gonna get some water bottles back there very quickly one of the things to remember whenever you come in with the 499 pack you get a $50 certificate to be used at that M gear store. So you can buy whatever you want, whether you want to spend that on business cards, whether you want to buy a new t-shirt or a new hat or whatever it is that you want to use there. Okay. So then the e-wallet home. Now this is e-wallet is your way of getting paid. We told you when you get paid. Um, this is where you're going to go and set up your e-wallet. And this is a basically like your bank account. Um, and you're going to set this up from there. Um, if you're if you signed up as a name and a social security number like the majority of people do Then that will be a fairly simple process if you are outside the US or if you came in under a business entity You might need to get customer service involved. It's a little little trickier pro, um, It's pretty self-explanatory, but, but there's just a little so, bit more to so it. go through that um, You will receive the day that you earn your first commission. You will receive an email from M network that explains how to set up your e-wallet. They don't send it out ahead of time simply because they don't want thousands of accounts if people don't earn any money. So we don't want a bunch of blank accounts out there. So you're gonna set up your e-wallet and you are going to um, just follow those directions and then from there, your commissions will already be in there that you just earned that day and you can choose then to order your M card. Show me the M card. We'll hide the number. But. So yeah, there's there's the M card, this really cool little M card. And uh, so you can go on there and you can order your M debit card. Uh, you can have the money transferred to your personal bank account and different things, just 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 go through that system. It's really not as difficult um, you know, for most people as, as you can. And then of course there's sending samples that will be coming soon and we cannot wait to do that where we can just simply put in their name and their address and send samples out instantly and immediately right from M network and it's amazing training there's there's about three training courses on there right now um, they're real short they're they're mostly about uh, promotions and incentives so make sure you get on there and that you're in the know for that and then your settings if you're brand new then you should be good to go on all of these but your account is your um, if you move you might need, might need to change your address or if you change an email site you might want to change that on account um, your marketing sites again this is where if you didn't like your username uh, then you, you you could go in there and you could change that username and password and stuff there communication that's a fun one um, this is where you can set up alerts uh, and these here, are, she, she's got and set up the cha-ching alert on her phone so that whenever we get the uh, announcements that say that uh, hey so-and-so is coming to your business or so-and-so made an order, you know, so at the top of the hour, we get this cha-ching, cha-ching, cha-ching. So hey, I guess you can do that. But, uh, you, you do it, what you need to to stay motivated. And, you know, when you're hearing cha-ching at the top of every hour, that's that's pretty motivating, I think. So, So, but I, you can set it up to be email if you don't want them to be text alerts. You can set up for email, text alerts. You choose what you want. I get text alerts for new orders, new members, um, and rank advancements. Those are the three I get. And... Um, 
anyway, that's so so they're really it's really a neat thing. So go in and set up your alerts. That way you're you're in the know of your team. And when that when that multiplication, when that that magic is starting to happen, that is really fun. You see people enrolling people and you're like, I didn't even know the person that enrolled that person. So and then but you know, you know, I can reach out and say, Hey, congratulations on signing them up. That's fantastic. So it's a great thing. Billing, that's where they store your um your debit card information and when you get started whatever debit card you used or credit card you used to get set up that's what's going to be in there now your goal is to eventually get that changed to your m card so you're going to change that because what do we want we want our our business income to take care of our business expenses and really so far with m the only expense we've had has been our product, our our blue box, and then our extra orders that we make. So, um, you know, making sure that you make money before you spend money is something that's very important to me. I don't ask anyone to come in here and and spend money they can't make. I don't ask people to come in here and and do anything extra until but until they really are making the money. So now, so I went through the housekeeping, which is the boring stuff. So I'm going to throw this over to AJ, and he's going to talk about how you actually start getting people in, how you make more money, and we're going to do this in about another – we're going to be as fast as we possibly can. But. So real quick, let me talk to you about the business centers. All right, so now you may or may not understand what the business center – maybe you haven't even heard what a business center is yet. And uh, so I'm going to give you the real quick basics of it, and then what I'm going to say is you need to go and watch. There is another video that is called maximizing the M power plan. All right, it is the next step of the power plan. This is the secret to the big money, okay? If you are looking to make, which I know that that's why it is that we're all in business, is because we wanna make money. Now granted, yeah, we wanna help people, we get healthy and everything, but the thing is, is we want to make some money, we want to supply for our families, we have goals, we have dreams, the things, our why of what it is that we're doing this for. The secret to the big money is in those business centers. Now, when you sign up for the $4.99 pack, you automatically get two business centers. A business center, what that is, is basically another spot. It's like you are buying two more locations in your uh, matrix, in your downline, all right? So you're basically able to double dip is what this is. So rather than making 5% of income on people that are there, you have the ability to make 10% of the income. Now here's the other thing that you can do with these business centers. Let's say that you have someone that comes into your organization and they're uh, seven, eight levels down or they're 12, 13 levels down in your organization as your things start to grow. And it's like, wow, this is going to be someone who's going to be a great business builder. But hey, the business plan only pays about 12 levels down. So I'm not really going to get paid off that. That's where you put a business center in. You take one of your business centers and have it activated underneath that person, and you've just opened up a whole nother 12 levels of income underneath that group down there also. The thing with that is, remember, you, you do need to fund those business centers in order to make the money off. You do not have to qualify them as far as the uh, everything for rank advancements because they follow the rank that you're at. So when you go to 1K, your business centers automatically become a one. Or uh, when you go to <laughs> an M1. M1, your business centers automatically go to the uh, same thing to an M1. When you move yes. forward and so <laughs> forth. I know people are looking at me right now and people, everybody's shaking well, their heads. So, <laughs> no, what so, you're so let me just say for business centers, when you come in with that 499 pack, you get two of those immediately. If you sign someone up at that $4.99, when you get to the end of that process, as soon as it's done and you've got their ID number and it's confirmed, immediately to the right bottom of your screen is a little blue button that says chat or something like that. Yeah. Um, click that, send a quick little email. It's not really a live chat, it's really an email. Send a little email that says such and such ID number with this name once their two business centers placed right up front. Boom, you send it. If it's the middle of the night, it's time stamped and they will get that put in right away where it needs to be. You need that now, put in right away. You need that right away because your business may start growing and you'll be like, okay, well, it's further down, which further down, like he said, works out very well um, as well too. So it's not like you missed the boat if you didn't come in with the 499. The other way you earn business centers is by recruiting three people. Every time, forevermore, 
that you recruit three people, you have the ability to place another business center anywhere in your group. Now, currently, we have six, I think, business centers, five or six business centers. Now, each one of those, as I said, has to be funded, and that's 60 PV, which is about $80 per one. Now, we probably drink enough sticks and take enough burn to make that um, just fine because it might be the products, the amount of products we use. But it doesn't have to be just your personal order. That's also your retail volume. If you're out there generating retail volume on your website or in a store or in whatever, that retail volume counts towards your business centers as well. So that doesn't have to just be something that you're doing. But the other thing is, is for us, they're doubling our paycheck. So they definitely pay for themselves um, as you get, as you grow. So again, go to whenever you're ready and you have a business center that you want to activate, whether it's one that you earned by getting three people or, uh, and again, for every three people, so you can earn multiple ones over and over and over, or whether you come in with two extra ones right at the very beginning, go to that little flag at the right-hand side of your screen whenever you're on your back office that says uh, contact us or live chat or whatever it says there, and uh, click on that and send that message, please activate the business center and then you just tell them where it is that you want that. So how do I get my business started? So here's the thing, we got a system. It's an easy three-step system. Step one, share a stick. Step two, share a tool. And step three, share a leader. All right, share a stick, share a tool, share a leader. That's how you build this system. You share a stick, you know, give a sample. Low, you know, open up a, a sample, you know, a, a stick in front of someone when you're at work and you're on break and, and fill it up in your water bottle in front of people. Cause them to start asking questions. Say, hey, well, you want to try it? It's something pretty neat. Share a tool and which your tools, that's going to be your websites. That's going to be the videos. Uh, you'll find those in your documents and media underneath tools, again, in your back office. So uh, is where you find the videos. The websites, you already, we already talked about that, where those are. Step three, share a leader. How do you share a leader? Well, a, three, a leader is gonna be through a three-way call or a three-way message chat or, or a three-way call on Facebook, or it's gonna be on a Zoom cast, or it's gonna be at a live events, live meetings. So that's how it is that you share a leader, is getting someone, doing that three-way call, getting a leader to talk to the person that you're uh, sharing this with. So well, where do I find my customers? Where do I find my business partners? The best place to start, right off the bat, everyone's got it. You can use social media, you got your family and friends, and then you got your referrals. Well, I don't know anybody. I only know about three people and they don't have any money and they wouldn't do anything. You know what, I bet you one of those people knows someone. So talk to them and say, you know what? Or hey. you might need to make some more friends. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that might be a good idea. Uh, so you know, as you're sharing with people, say, you know what? I have something. I don't know if this is something you'd be interested in or not, but you may know of somebody that you think that might be interested in this. Let me share a sample with you and let you look at my website and tell me what you think. And then you can let me know who, you, who it is that you think might be interested in this. That's how you get a referral, real easy. And uh, social media, family and friends, so you've got those different ways. What do I say? All right. Everyone says, oh, I don't know what to say what, and everything. Don't use this word for word. This is just an example of something to use to kind of get your brain started, okay? So what do I say? Here's kind of the thing. Hey, I'm getting in a new, a new business started, and it's based on an energy drink that's actually good for you and a weight loss drink that really gets results. I'd love to get your feedback. Would you be open to trying the sample and check out my business website? That's it. That's what you say. That's, that's how you share it. That's how you get things going. What you're doing right there, you're sharing a stick and you are sharing a tool all in one spot. All right. The other thing, well, you're you don't know very many people. So you go meet someone new. What do you say? Well, hey, you, what do you say? You're always asking, you know, that's kind of the icebreaker you say to people. What do I do? What do you do? What do you do for a living? Oh, really? Do you love it? All right, do you plan to retire there? Well, let me ask you, do you keep your options open? Now, I'll tell you, I, I'm working with a brand new company. It's called M Network, and they're currently expanding their product line of some healthy energy drinks and weight loss products in the area. Well, let me send you a link to my website and a sample of our product. You never know. might be something that will get your attention. How easy is that?
It's really simple. Again, this is not brain surgery. It's just, and again, you don't have to use those word for word. It's just, you know, finding you know, a, a way that works for you in getting that going. The things to remember, there's three things that everyone is asking themselves before they get involved. All right. Assuming they, they already know cost, which yeah. with M, we don't have to apologize cost. It's affordable. People are not having to depend or decide between a car payment or filling the refrigerator up versus buying product. It is affordable and, and it's cheaper than anything on, in competition with them, which by the way, our competition is not other network marketing companies. Our competition is the stuff on the shelves in 7-Eleven, in the convenience stores, in Walmarts. And we're, we're competing with things like Gatorade and Monster. And if you pull up on Amazon, a 24 um, can of, of um, Monster or Red Bull costs more than what our 30 day supply of natural great products are so you know oh that was my little side bit but <laughs> so the three <laughs> things whether you're talking to someone that uh, you've known for a long time or you're talking to someone brand new when they're trying to determine is this something that's for me or not once they've got the basics out of the way of how much it costs and everything and what does it taste like they want to know do i trust those involved do i trust the company do i trust the leaders do i trust the person introducing this to me they want to know can I see myself doing this? And they want to know who's going to show me how to do this. Cause I don't know that I get this yet. I don't know that I understand matrix. What is the matrix? It's a movie, you know, <laughs> you're, and you're saying that, that I'm going to make the money with a movie here. So, you know, who's going to show me how to do this. And that's where it comes in to the last thing that we were saying, as far as our system. All right. Remember the system is share a stick, share a tool, and then share a leader. So this is where you need to share a leader, all right? You're going to do a three-way, whether that's a, a three-way call, a three-way message chat, Facebook, or whatever it is, and you're going to be getting that person on the line. And that person is going to do these things. That leader is going to be uh, someone who you're going to bridge that gap through this first thing it's called ed edification. And you're going to be driving them uh, together, uh, bridging that gap in there. And you're gonna, they're going to be helping them to understand uh, if they see themselves doing this. And they're going to be also, you're going to be introducing them as the person who's going to help to show them how to do this. So sharing the leader, who do I do a three-way with? Who, who do I do this with? You're going to do it with your upline or your upline leader. All now, right. it does not have to be your upline or upline leader. If I'm if I'm talking to someone and I know that they're going to relate very well um, with um, another homeschool mom or something, I might it may not be upline to me. It, it that's fine. You connect people with who they're going to connect with, and and that's really important. So how do you set it up? It's just common sense, you know. Hey, you you tell the prospect, you tell the person you're talking to. Hey, I want to have you talk to John. He's working with me on this and you know what? He can do a whole much better job of answering your questions and explain how it all works. Now, the nice thing about having this is the fact that what you've done right there is you've alleviated the need of having to be the expert yourself to them whenever they have their questions. What you want to be able to do is make sure they know that they can see themselves doing this. Again, that's the set. That's the second thing that they're wondering about in their own mind is do I see myself doing this? If they feel like in order to be doing this, they have to know all the answers to all the questions. They have to understand how the compensation plan works and how all the ingredients work in the product and, and all that. They're going to say, you know what? I don't know that I can do that. That's just more than I can handle. That's why it's easy to say, you know what? Let me let you talk to, uh, to John or, or to Mary or to Bob. And let me let you talk to them because they can help explain this a whole lot better and uh, they can answer the questions and then you just give uh, John or Leonard or whoever it is a call and say hey John I've got a friend who's interested and I'd love for you to talk to them are you available at such and such time that's how you set it up really simple don't be afraid to call and ask someone to do a three-way call because when you're in this business that's what it's about that's how you build your business you're going to be doing the same thing for your downline as you get to knowing more and more about this. And as you're doing those three-way calls and those three-way chats and in those Zoom casts, you're going to be learning at the same time and you're going to learn what to say and, and how to present things. Because already on this call, some of you are that, that leader and then some of you are going to be that leader. 
So you need to know both sides of it because you're, you're not, but even as a leader, you're still connecting them. You're, we've got someone on our team that has made more money than my brain can even fathom. Yet he calls us every day for three way calls. Why? Why would he call me? Why would he call AJ for a three way call? Because he understands the power of that, that expert um, connection, that, that third party expert. And he knows that. And if he made as much money as he's made in this industry doing that, then guess what? I'm going to make sure I'm doing that too. Now I don't always do three way calls. Like AJ said, I do a lot of um, messenger chats. I do a lot of instant zooms um, mainly because my, my cell phone service right now stinks where I'm at and I'm working on that. Um, but so I'm doing a lot of message chats with people and I'm doing a lot of, of instant zooms. Hey, you got a minute? Let's, let's jump on, on the internet. Let's jump on here and, and get to meet one another. And, and I love the zooms too, cause they're face to face. Mm. So, so the execution of the three way call, how do you get things going? You know, it's all about edification and making sure that uh, they know uh, what, you know, who they're talking to. Again, who is it that's going to be showing them how to do that? You want to make sure that you show this is an expert in this that you, you know, want to be listening to. So the edification comes into it. It may be, hey, Mike, I want to introduce you to Mary. Mary's an incredible leader in this company. I've, I've learned so much from her about how to make this business work. And if you were to decide that you wanted to get involved, you'd be able to be working with her too. And I'm sure when you hear what she has to say, you're going to be as excited as I am to be able to work directly with leaders just like Mary. And uh, Mary, this is Mike. He's uh, the one I told you about that could be a fabulous leader. Now, what you've done here is uh, you have done the edification. You have positioned the Mary or whoever it is that you've got as your leader here, your third-party expert as a third-party expert. All right, They don't have that trust yet. So you're bridging that gap for that trust so that they understand who it is they're talking to. And they're learning now a little bit about why it is that you believe in Mary or John or Leonard or Andy or whoever it is that you are putting on that phone call. All right. So they're learning, they're learning about that and you're building that bridge in there. And they're also learning a little bit about why it is that uh, they would be wanting to work with them. And then at the same time, whenever you're introducing uh, uh, them to your upline, you want to edify this person because it's going to make them feel like, Oh, I'm a valued person. You know, they see me as someone who could actually be this. It puts in the mindset that, Oh yeah, that's right. I could be a leader at this. And then the next step after that, be quiet, let them talk. What you don't want to do is you don't want to get on a three way call and say, let me introduce you to the leader. This is Jill. She's going to tell you all about it. Go ahead, Jill. <laughs> Go ahead and start telling about it. Oh yeah, this is M Network. It is incredible. <laughs> You're gonna love it. You know, and and I, I'm doing this over here, and you go start inter you know, interrupting. Uh, let the leader be the leader. Let them. There's a reason why you're making them the expert here to the person. All right, they're gonna be listening to you a whole lot. The uh, the person you're putting on the call but they have limited time with the leader. So this is the time to let them do the talking. So the final thing here is treat this like a business and it's going to pay you handsomely. You treat it like a hobby and it's going to pay you like a hobby. All right. So keep that in mind. How, what is your mindset? How are you doing this business? So one of the main things we, we always want to stress on every call is consistency. Um, you know, consistent, consistent, consistent. Um, you have to be plugged in, um, get plugged into the Facebook groups. Um, even your prospects, um, uh, make sure that they're on the, uh, Im improve. Uh, when, when you share a sample, I share the improved site and I, I, I add them to the improve. I tell them I'm going to add you to the Facebook site and there's testimonies on there. If I know they're looking for weight loss, then I'm going to even go through, uh, through there and I'm going to tag them, which just means you type their name in the comments that will tag your prospect to that so that they'll get notification. You're sending them right to the source of another third party testimonial. So it's, it's really, really powerful. And all of this stuff is free. Social media and all of these things, the zoom calls, everything is free. That's what's just blows my mind. The technology that we have right now. Um, if you, if anyone was back in the day, Amway or whatever, you know that you spent a fortune in long distance. You spent a fortune in, in, in postage. You spent all this stuff and, and just to get 
the things that we have in our hands right now, it's unbelievable. And so plug in, it's up to you. Like we started this call, it's about you. You have to take responsibility to make sure that you're plugged in. If, as John Zena says, if you're not plugged in, you're plugged out. Don't be plugged out. Be plugged in and stay involved. Get involved. Um, don't expect everyone to pull you along and drag you along with them. You have to make that decision to step up and, and plug in. That plugging in is going to really help your mindset. And also when you're talking to other people, keep that same mindset, that excitement and that enthusiasm. Remember, excitement, enthusiasm, that's contagious. If you're a downer, you know what? That's going to be contagious too. And people aren't, you're going to drain the life out of people. So we're going to change you that energy dialect. And by being plugged in, you change your mm -hmm. inner dialect. You change your vocabulary. You change the way you speak and the way you believe about something. So being plugged in, that's why people, sorry, but that's why people go to church. Can you be a Christian and not go to church or whatever your affiliation is? Yes, you can, but you need that plugged in so that you stay there, that that belief stays strong and that you're in a community of people. And that is something that M Network, we have such an amazing community. I had a new um, member uh, from a couple weeks ago said, well, this is weird. I keep getting friend requests from these people that are all in M. Why is, that's just weird. One was from Australia. Sorry, Jody. But, and I, I was like, oh, well, you better get used to that. You're going to get a lot of those, but because we're a community, we support one another. We love each other's posts. We like each other's posts. We comment and we like comments and stuff because that helps generate the excitement. It helps build the algorithm for Facebook and all the stuff. We won't get into all the marketing techniques of Facebook on this call, but that's what we do. We, we are community and I love, love, love it. And there's a great incentive trip to Cabo where we, we hopefully can all be on there. There's what, 61 people on this call right now. And hopefully we can all 61 of us be in Cabo in October and it's not hard to achieve and you can achieve it in less than a month. If you really just got down and got busy working it and lean on your leaders to help you do that, you can do that in a month, but truly you have till the end of September to qualify. Um, so we, there's no reason why we can't all be on that Cabo trip. A lot, a lot of you that are on this call and a lot of other people that are uh, in our organization, they're already uh, qualified for this trip. And uh, so we can't wait to see everybody there and get you as a part of this trip as well. It's not too late, just like Jill said. I know you may just be beginning right now. Maybe you signed up uh, with M Network yesterday or maybe it was earlier today. Here's the thing, you got time because uh, people are doing that and getting qualified in just a matter, some in a matter of weeks, some in a matter of just a few months. We've got all the way till the end of September. So you have time to make it because we want to see you because we love hanging out with everybody and we want to hang out with you and uh, so does the rest of the team. And we're going to have a great party there and uh, we're going to all so be So here's your it. homework. On a training call, you always should end with a little bit of homework. Sorry, but you should. And here's what I want you to do. Where, wherever you're at in the world, because we've got everyone from all over, all over this planet, um, if you still have time today, go talk to two people. Go talk to two brand new people or follow up with two people that you have just kind of neglected to get back to. Um, if it's late in the night, then make your list. Write down um, three people that you're going to talk to tomorrow. And just do those steps like what AJ said. We get them going. You run them through the steps of sharing the sticks. Get them some samples. Get them a tool in their hand or send them to a website. Or you, you and then you share a leader with them. And you just do that. You just keep doing that. Will everyone come in? No, they won't. That's, that's just the name of the game. They won't. And, but that's okay. You're looking for the ones that will. It's like fishing. Not every fish bites. But the ones that bite, we're going to pull them in and we're going to, well, we're going to eat them, but that's different. Um, <laughs> but, you know, it's all about you you going out and making a difference. So write down those names. Uh, come come up with your list. What's the most, Im most important things that you need to do the next day for your business? Write those down before you go to bed at night. Make your list ahead of time. You'll be 95% ahead of the game by making your to-do list in order of importance the night before when you go to bed. Uh, you'll already be a step ahead of the game. So make those list of people, make the, write those down um, every night and, and just, um, we're here for you. We can help you. Like I said, it's not about us, it's about you. So reach out, whatever you need, we'll try to help you out along the way. And we will, like I said, we will tighten this up a little bit and get it a little bit shorter. We really wanted to do this in 45 minutes. So we'll tighten up our, our script a little bit um, for next week and we'll, uh, we'll, um, 
make yeah. it a little bit more effective, but we really just want to send everybody out there with a track to run on. Whether you signed up today or whether you signed up month one, you've got a place you can go to learn each week and you've got a place you can send your team to so that they can learn so that we're not, what we don't want to do is, is let anyone slip through the cracks that really want to make a difference in their lives. Don't forget that plugging in is so important. There's a lots of calls, uh, lots of things that are going on. Talk to your upline, talk to the people who got you in and ask them, hey, when are some of those calls going to be? Uh, there's things you can see some of it in the, your back office and the calendar. Uh, you can also uh, see if you go to uh, M Team events, uh, also Life by Design events. Uh, so some different places that you can find out. But a lot of it is getting uh, posted on Facebook. And uh, one of those events that are coming up, of course, we've got uh, – I know there's calls coming up tomorrow, but we've also got uh, a corporate call that's going to be starting here in just a few moments that we're going to go ahead and get off here so we can get on the corporate call uh, with Ryan Anderson. And then again, this coming Thursday at this same time, 7.30 Central Time, Ryan Anderson is going to be doing a special call for us, and uh, we're going to be sending that email out uh, later on tonight. That will be a call you don't want to miss. He's going to be that talking about the prospects. vision. Put every person in your pipeline on that call Thursday night, same time as tonight, same login right tonight, yep. tonight, um, and make sure that they have that. And because Ryan Anderson has something really unique in in the way he presents this, and he really shares the vision of M. And you need everybody on that call. So, have a great night. Love you guys. Sorry we took so long. Thank you, and uh, we'll talk to you all next time. Bye bye.